Oh, hello. I didn't know you were there. Very nice to see you again. I've managed to break my computer screen, which is incredibly annoying because I'm going to have to try to replace it. And I'm not very good at that. But anyway, enough of my problems. There's lots to do today. And I want to show you something. This is the book that I want to share with you today, A Hands-On Introduction to Data Science by Chirag Shah, published by Cambridge University Press. And it's a very nice production. It comes in at £40, which I think is a lot of money for a book. But this book is good value. You can see the quality of it. Nice hardback, good quality paper, printed in colour, uh, nice pictures and illustrations. It's it's very pleasant to read and it's very well explained. The topics it covers are very well explained indeed. But is this book for you? Let's take a closer look. It's a bit like the sort of introduction you might get if you were on a university graduate program for a social science where you don't come from a quantitative background, but you need to get up to speed on how to handle data and derive insight from data quite quickly. It's the sort of thing they would cover in a course like that. And it's covered really well. So let's take a look at the contents of this book. And it starts off, the first chapter is just an introduction about what data science is, where you will find applications of data science, and then how does data science relate to other fields. So this is really useful for complete newcomers. Uh, and there's a little section on computational thinking, which is handy too, and also the skills and tools that are required for data science. So you can really start with no knowledge at all, and this gives you a nice background into the whole field. The next chapter is all about data, what data is, what forms it comes in, where to find data, and then how to pre-process data. And then we start getting onto things like uh, data analysis, basic data analysis and descriptive statistics, and then predictive analytics. So another useful chapter for newcomers. So you really don't need a lot of knowledge going into this. It covers Unix, Python, Ah, MySQL, it's really comprehensive. There's a little bit of theory, machine learning for data science, a little brief summary of what it is, and then we look at specific supervised learning techniques, so logistic regression, softmax regression, then decision trees, random forest, naive bays, support vector machines. So it's really quite a thorough introduction. And then we have the unsupervised learning techniques. I think this book would be really good for someone that doesn't have a background in using computers and computer programs in order to handle data. And it will take them really quite a long way down that path in order to be able to do that and to gain useful insights from the data that they have and to understand the, the data landscape. So if you fall into that category, whether you're a graduate student or a professional or just someone that's interested in data, then this book could definitely be for you. There are a lot of really useful practical examples in this book and the problems which come in orange boxes are pitched at just about the right level as well. There's nothing intimidating about the book. And once it's taught you some of the machine learning techniques that are commonly used in data science, there's a nice section at the end of projects. For example, there's one on collecting and analyzing YouTube data, which, you know, you're probably interested in YouTube seeing as you're on the platform. You know, that's a nice project. And there are other similar projects too. By the time you complete this book, you'll have a really good understanding of what data science is and on a practical level, what it actually involves and how to apply those methods yourself. You may then want to go away and understand the maths behind it all a little bit better but this will put you in a really good position to do that. So if you don't come from a quantitative background and you want a nice, well-explained introduction to data science, then definitely consider this book. So it gets the thumbs up from me.